Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Mark Light Field at Alex Rodriguez Park on the campus of the University of Miami. And the first pitch from the senior right-hander is a called strike on the outside corner. 2-2 Two -two to Loper Fido. Misses inside. I take, take oh. that back. It nicked him, much to the dismay of Fetterman. You know, the batter to chase. Pitches inside, throw down to second base, and Adrian Del Castillo gets Joey Loper Fido trying to steal. Players all around. Lines that one down the left field line. He'll get down for extra bases, and Anthony Villar is the first base runner of the day for the Hurricanes. Two-two lifted in the center field, and that should get the job done. Anthony Villar digging for home, and he will score. Yohandi Morales with a sacrifice fly to open up the scoring. Hey everyone, Wheels here. I want to remind you all to hit that subscribe button because over 80% of you watching right now are not subbed to the channel. It's completely free and helps me out a lot. Thanks everyone, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Ground ball left side. This could be two. Patelli, Villar, Terrell, Miami turns it. And Daniel Fetterman gets Peter Matt to bounce into a double play and get out of the inning. The ACC co-player of the week after his first weekend of conference play. And he's got a home run right there that could help him win ACC player, ACC player of the week honors once again. That is the first home run as a Miami Hurricane for Christian Del Castillo. I mean, he gets a fastball up, and we're singing his praises. Great student, having a great season, and the one thing he hadn't done was hit a home run. Right. The Duke second baseman will bat now. First pitch swinging, lines it to right field. That'll get down for extra bases. Gabe Rivera running into the corner as Hoyle will stop at second with a stand-up two-out double. There we go. He's tied for second on the team with 15 hits, and he's got a hit right there. This could score a run. Christian Del Castillo coming in. The throw to his brother is not in time. And the nine-hole hitter, Chase Creek, drives in Will Hoyle, and the Blue Devils slice the deficit in half. 0-1. Bouncer left side. Morales fields it over to Terrell, and Fetterman's able to limit the damage. Staff here and doing a great job. And that will raise the ERA. Alex Terrell, a solo shot to right field on an 0-2 pitch. Doubles Miami's lead. We're here talking about, you know, how, how well Stinson is doing, getting ahead of guys and makes a mistake, leaves a fastball up and into Terrell, who does not miss it. And we spoke earlier about Terrell's plate discipline improving and how streaky of a hit. 3-2, skied high. Shallow left center, Murray going back on it, Shrek coming in on it, and the left fielder makes the grab. Castillo sets that glove down nice and low. Arguez hit the spot, but it's driven out to left field and reeled in. And I win. And there it is. Four straight strikeouts to end the night, and Carson Palmquist has his eighth save of the season. Yohandi Morales. Dominic Patelli, Anthony Villar, and Alex Terrell as the first pitch is grounded right to Villar. One pitch and one out. They are aware of how to run the bases for sure. There's a Del rocket. Del Castillo rips it into right field. And Anthony Villar will be sent. The throw is cut off. And Adrian Del Castillo has the first RBI of the night. The Canes lead 1-0 in the bottom of the first. All right, Adrian Del Castillo. 94 with two outs this season. There Five it of is. 17. There Make it, it is. 6 of 18. Terrell knocks it into left field. Hang Christian on. Del Castillo is sent, and he will score. Excuse me, Adrian Del Castillo. And the Hurricanes take a 2-0. Looking forward to watching him progress. Well, that's a nice piece of hitting from Dominic Patelli underneath the outstretched glove of Erickson Nichols and Miami has the leadoff man on. I was in physical therapy for about a month when I strained my oblique because Adam Frank grounds that one oh. short and Duke won't even get an out out of it. But uh, I do think Alejandro is probably in a little bit better physical condition. A ton of PFPs, but it is a hard play to make. Instead, There's it's right at Ethan Murray, had another chance. It bounces off of him and goes into right center field. Coming around to score is Dominic Patelli. It's an RBI single. Adam Frank goes to third. It's 3 nothing Hurricanes. Going or a slider down and in. 1-2, oh, ripped to the right side. It's past the diving Will Hoyle. 
and into the outfield, and that will score two runs for the Hurricanes. Miami is breaking it open early at the light. Oh, he took advantage of that foul. A mistake, Adrian Del Castillo bounces it to the left oh. side, and he beats the shift, and it will score Anthony Villar. It's 6-0 Hurricanes, and Adrian Del Castillo, man, is that guy a great hitter. He's just a great 100 games of his career, pitch 51 to Christian Del Castillo, is lifted to right field. He can't and see it. Peter Matt, for the second night in a row, loses a ball in the lights. And that will go down as a single. Uh, hopefully he, the, the, the luck here oh, can change boy. for him. Well, it won't be on that pitch. The pass ball on Rothenberg. Back to back pitches goes from Miami with runners on first and second to a man scoring and a man on third. ECC a couple years ago. He grounds that to the left side off the glove of Erickson Nichols. And that is the 10th single of the day for the Hurricanes. It would be hard to be unluckier than Henry Williams. Look at that at that plate appearance by Alex Terrell as Raymond Gill knocks that one into right field. Christian Del Castillo is waved around and he is gunned down at wow. the plate by Peter Matt. What a throw by the graduate student transfer from Pennsylvania to get the graduate student transfer from Seton Hall at the dish. Uh also been a couple other balls they just missed on and that ground ball could be another one it is a third error for Ethan Murray and that one leads to a run as Raymond Gill scored understanding that he was able to get that ground ball ground ball through the hole on the left side and for the first time tonight the Blue Devils have two men on base as Ethan Murray right. singles got to feel good Medeiros is absolutely rolling through four innings. He gets uh -oh. into the fifth, uh -oh. and now it's even more similar to last week. A this. grand slam for the Blue Devils. Joey Loper Fito drills it over the left field fence, and just like that, Duke is back in this ball game. Oh, that was beautiful. He was able to get that two seamer up in the zone, letting it get deep into the into his stand, and just absolutely short swing. Well, you, are you not scared of? Oh, there's a. Oh, oh boy, this could Rocketed be trouble. to second base. It'll be a double play that scores a run. Drives it into left center field. That'll get down for another base hit and another RBI. Christian Del Castillo, four for four, four singles and a walk. Have a night. We have a long season ahead of us, but we understand we can do some damage still. Joey Loper Fido drives that one to right center field. That'll get down for a ground rule double. And coming in to score is Chase Cheek. So Loper Fido's had himself a nice night. He's got a grand slam, and now he's got an RBI. Direct has continued to stay alive. And not anymore. Jake Smith gets him swinging on the breaking ball. And Miami takes the series from the Blue Devils. An 11-5 win. Left to right, Lala Del Castillo and Rivera. First pitch in there for a strike. Back up the middle. A step on second for one. On the first double play. Boyle unassisted turns a double play to win the end. Yes. Check swing. Did he go around? Yes, he did. Strike three. And that's all for the Blue Devils in the third. Strike three called in the inside corner. Terry strikes out. Villar looking. Gill hits this one toward the alley. Is going to be trouble? No. Chase Creek is there to chase it down. Sun today, the one two. Fisted, and this one is served in the center field for a base hit. Rothenberg is going to challenge the arm of Del Castillo, and the throw is going to be late. That'll be an extra base hit for Michael Rothenberg. Lines this one into right field for a base hit. And a run will score. Rothenberg scores but without attracting a throw to the plate. The play is at second base and it's not in time. It's a double. How about that? The number nine hitter. <laughs> That's a heck of an a bat right there. Patelli draws a walk. Got a big lead at first. Oh. Yeah. And now Miami is runners at first and second. That one gets by the catcher and the Miami runners will move up to second and third. Team in the way near is Villar. First ball swinging. Hits this one on one hop to the second baseman. He'll make the play and a run will score. That ties the ball game. Patelli scores.
Here's the 1-0. And Morales hits this one to deep left field. And this ball is gone. It's a home run for Morales to left field. That one left the ballpark in a hurry. Morales with a two-run homer. And Miami has a three-to-one lead here in the fifth inning. Ball two, strike two. A swing and a miss. He struck him out. And that's all for the Blue Devils. Arguez comes on and tiptoes through a minefield. Del Castillo. And he lines this one in the center field for a base hit. Morales on his way to third. He'll be there without attracting a throw. Del Castillo with an RBI single and an insurance run for my... On the ground with the second baseman. Bobbles it. Now only one play for Hoyt in time. And a run will score. Morales scores from third. And Miami has two... First ball swinging. Hits this one in the right center field for a base hit. Here comes Del Castillo around third, and he is going to score standing up. Play is at second, nine in time, and Capus has a big RBI for Miami. Vitelli hits this one in the center field for a base hit. Here comes the throw. It's going to be up the line in two late. And Vitelli slides into second base. He picks up an RBI, and Miami leads it 7-1. to one. Strike three called, and that's the ball game. In two hours and 33 minutes, the University of Miami defeats the Duke Blue Devils 7-1. And they sweep the series.